Alright bro, so what's up guys, Airball here and back in the video, and today I'm showing you guys the best Lori Mark in the build on VHK23. So this build, I mean, this build can shoot the ball, can get contact dunks, play defense, handle the ball well, uh, decently fast too, and has an 82 strength, which will get you the silver bully. Um, but you're probably wondering why I'm doing a Lori Markinet build. Honestly, the only reason I'm making a Lori Markinet build is because this dude is literally balling out for the Jazz right now. Like, he's literally becoming, he's going to become an all-star, I'm pretty sure. This dude has just been, like, balling out for the Jazz, so that's why I decided to make a build video on him. But this is basically a 6'11 small forward that can do it all. So make sure you stay tuned. And yeah, let's get into it. So I'm going to go small forward for the position. Height, 6'11. Weight, 227. And the wingspan, you want to go with 7'6 um, on the wingspan. All right, 7'6. Just get that three ball up a little bit. Um, and technically since you can't play big on this build, I will put built body shape um, just because it'll help you out against like other bigs and stuff So yeah, the close shot. I mean all around the finishing is gonna be really solid 80 close shot 80 driving layup 85 for the driving dunk right here They put the standing dunk up to an 80 so I'll give you the um, pro contact dunks and then the pro big man contact dunks So yeah, even though you're a small forward you can still get the big man contact dunks because you are uh, taller than 610 or 69 actually so yeah uh, the post control, you want to put that up to an 80. That'll give you 20 finishing badges. Uh, but for the shooting, you want to put the mid-range shot up to a 76. Uh, you want to put the three ball to the max 84. You want to put the um, free throw up to a 62. That'll give you 19 uh, shooting badges. The playmaking, you want to put the pass accuracy up to a 67. Put the ball handling up to a 72, which is the max. And then max out the... Or not max out the speed of the ball. Put it down to uh, 65. That'll give you 10 uh, playmaking badges right here. Now, the defense, you want to put the interior defense up to an 82. Um, you want to put the perimeter to the max 74. Um, you want to max out the steal. You want to put the block up to an 84. Uh, you want to put the offensive rebounding up to an 80. You want to put the defensive rebounding up to an 85. That'll give you 22 defensive badges. So 85 defensive rebound will get you silver rebound chaser. Um, let's see, where's the rebound chaser? Right here. So you need either 85 offensive rebound or 85 defensive rebound. Um, but yeah, rebound chaser will definitely help out a lot with this build. Especially because you can basically do everything else. You can handle the ball decently. You can shoot the ball, get contacts, and play in the post a little bit for playing against smaller players. Um, but yeah, you want to max out the speed. You want to put the strength up to an 82. And then put the vert to a 75. And then put the stamina up to the... Uh, put up to 95. And yeah, that is the build. So 20 finishing, 19 shooting, 10 playmaking, and 22... Uh, defensive badges right here is a total of 71 badges, I believe. So honestly, really solid for the bad spread. Uh, but the takeover, I'm gonna go sharp and then slashing as the uh, secondary. Sharp and slashing, they're probably like the two most toxic takeovers in the game. Um, but yeah, this is the build. It's called an inside out score shade. There's Xavier McDaniel, Michael Porter Jr., and Brandon Ingram. So moving on to the badges right here. I mean, look at the badges we can get right here. All right, limitless takeoff, bully, posterizer, slithery, masher, fearless finisher. Drop stepper, and then I'm just gonna go with uh, back down punisher on bronze. Now for the shooting, and honestly, it depends if you're spotting up on this build. But since you're 6'11, I'm, I'm just gonna guess that you're spotting up. But you can adjust the badges according to how you're playing. So if you're running like sort of guard, like if you want to, you can like put on like agent three, um, stuff like that. Um, but for me, I'm gonna put on spot up badges. So I'm actually gonna take off agent three and then put on a uh, comeback kid, green machine, mini magician on bronze, and then I'm gonna go guard up on uh, bronze. The playmaking, you want to put Dimer, uh, Quick First Step, Vice Grip on Silver. Actually, no, I'm going to put it on Bronze and then put Unpluckable on Bronze. Or not Silver. Or, no, it's Silver, not Bronze. Uh, post Playmaker, Clamp Breaker. Then I'm going to put Floor General and then Break Starter on Bronze. Now for the defense, you will be able to get a lot of defensive badges here. 22 defensive badges is nice. Uh, but Anchor, Brick Wall, Pig Dodger, uh, Rebound Chaser, Interceptor, Challenger, Pogo Stick on Silver. And post lockdown, uh, box out beast on let's see, gold chase on artist on uh, silver as well. And yeah, that's it. If you like the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. This is Airball. Peace.